Hello everybody, Jetpack Buddha here. Welcome back to another episode of Starbound. In today's episode, we're going to be fighting the Ark, which is the final boss, I think. Or the Ruin, more or less. So, I guess let's just get straight to business. Just want to double check that everything's going smoothly. Readings indicate that while the structure would appear to be a planet, it is in fact one giant living organism. Oh, and I almost walked straight into poison. Ha 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 ha. Silly me. Also, you can literally just mine tentacles. Oh, they drop. Oh, and that. Okay. Yeah, there's literally just a bunch of poison. Let's just... Also, I've decided that I'm going to use the Protectorate Sword. Because, apparently, it's better. I have no idea where I'm supposed to be going. Guess maybe just explore or something. I'm just running at this point. Okay. a good amount of damage would be nice if the poison wasn't So where am I even supposed to be going? Alright. Yeah, I want to beam up because... Ah, uh, yeah. I'm not sure what's going on there. All I know is that it's in incredibly deadly. Have a blessing. Okay, a mint. I mean, a hint. Okay, uh, do we just, may, may we just have to dig? Okay, cool, but it still doesn't let me know what I'm supposed to be doing. But I'm glad to know that it's a tentacle cl cl cluster. Incredibly helpful. Keep on pausing because I've been playing so much Stardew Valley that I've just been. I'm just pressing the wrong buttons. I guess we just... I'm not sure what we do, actually. And I got myself into some poison again. Silly me. Always getting into poisonous substances.
guess I'm gonna like go to the core of the there's vast chasm beneath you that some sadism sleep and I just trying to avoid falling into the to death cool what the oh yeah I forgot the bird the bird completely negated my fall damage I oh and this is where You've reached the rune's heart, you must destroy it. Okay, thank you for telling me. Alright. Let's do this. Let's fight the ruin. What are you doing? I think I'll cut it off. Hmm, okay. You still haven't won. The round will still awaken and soon cleanse the universe of all but humans. Okay. Oh, hello, eyeball. How do you like tentacles, huh? Or tongues, more of the point. What are your views on tongues, good sir? What the? No. What the? Void balls? Ow! Okay, I am not... still harm it while it's doing its little big boy attack. What are your views on tentacles, good sir? Because you are being mutilated by some. Ow! Have your goonies stop exploding on me. Uh. Alright, orb time. I say as the orbs proceed to do absolutely nothing in our quest. Our quest of something or other. Feels kind of selfish that there, that no one else is helping me, especially after everyone was on my aid with the bone dragon fight. But you know what? Maybe they have better things to do. All right. Stop it. Alright. Ah, run away. <laughs> hey. Can you stop just firing your little goonies on me? I'd highly appreciate it if you actually, you know, 
fought me like a... I was about to say fight me like a man, but, like, this thing is the complete opposite of a man or a human in any way, shape, or form. Tentacle time. Or tongue time, I guess. I don't like how either of those sound, but it's the truth. Ow. Okay. Can you stop just giving birth? We already have enough enough baby Yoda memes. And I don't like baby Yoda memes. That's my secret. I'm not sure what exactly. Alright. Maybe we should have brought some people along. Oh. You did it, but something's wrong with the ruin. Its structure is unstable. Ouchie, no, don't shoot me. It's going to explode. Get out. Don't tell. They've dealt. Uh. Okay. Literally <laughs> just exploded. Oh, neato. This can't be. So that, that's very cinematic. Awesome. Protector, do not follow the myriad souls of those who came before you. Wasn't planning on following the souls. Though even though I succumbed to their own when we fought, I shattered Brook Park it into near infinite pieces. Much was simply lost through fat fragments of myself, ancient and wild, broke away and became something new. What little of myself remained stayed to watch what I had left behind. United my artifacts, Protector. The six races I gifted now stand as one. Ooh, am I going to become God? You have planted a seed of peace that will grow and spread throughout this vast universe. The ruin is destroyed, the universe is saved, but there is still so much to do. And now, to you, I give my final gift, last of myself, return protector, live again. Oh, neato. Whoa. Oh. Hmm. Well, since the credits are rolling, I guess I should give my thoughts. Uh, the game is pretty good, although... It is a bit short, I guess. Either that or I just spent a lot of stuff off episodes. It, it still felt like it gave, gave a lot of, of stuff to it. I must admit, though, that the soundtrack is probably one of the best soundtracks I've like ever heard in video games. It's just really good. Slot names. Yeah, there still actually is a lot of a lot to do, so I don't expect the series to end anytime soon. Maybe a small hiatus just so I can focus on other things. Yeah. So overall, this was a pretty good series. I mean, a pretty good game. The series was also might have been pretty good. I'm not sure, but yeah. It's kind of crazy to think that there still is a lot left to do. Those two are having dinner on the moon. And I think that there's post-game stuff as well. And there's the tree. 
And look, I'm also there. I'm with the gang. Oh, and... Okay, so that's it. Uh, do I just... Oh, oh, I guess now I just talk to Esther. Esther. And what do you have for me? At least take this. What is it? A thank you card. That eye was huge. What a hunt. I might know just. You might just be the second best hunter I know. Cluex would be proud of you. Bloody good show. You have taught me that there is always hope. Thank you. The scientific importance of your achievement is immeasurable. You have the heart of a protector. Thank you for saving the universe. We hope you enjoy playing Starbound every bit as we enjoyed making it. The universe is free to you to explore. Safe travels. Thank you, Checklefish. What is this? A short sword? A short sword. Uh, it's kind of a... And... Oh yeah, I forgot that there's other stuff as well. So now what? Do we just... Hey guys, I defeated, like... Satan or something. Let's all go to the party room. It's mandatory. There isn't even a party room. But you know what? We can always imagine that there is. Uh. No. So now what? Do we just. Revisor? Uh. Yes, but I would like in. Maybe we can go to the outpost. Might be something there. What? Hold on a second. There is something there. What do you have to say, little man? One's whisper of what you have done, but you have ventured far, young one. There are still doors you have to open. I can trade keys with you if you wish to open the ancient gates scattered among the stars. Okay. Okay. Venom sample equals a vault key. Hmm. Alright. Should we try to take on a vault? Yeah. Man. One thing that I kind of... It would be cool if they added, like, extra dialogue into the scene, but it's, like, that's kind of just, like, where everyone's just, like, whoa, it's the guy, the guy that did the thing, because I am the guy that did the thing. Alright, so, I would, maybe let's just try one of the vaults. Well, actually, let me check the time. Uh, no. Uh, might do one of the vaults in later episodes of Trade. Vault key. Enter a lone ancient gateway. Alright, well, we'll do that in the next episode. Because I'm going to end this episode here. Because, uh, because yeah, this game series is pretty nice. So, I will see you guys all later. And, goodbye.